Hello friends, welcome back to the Husky Squad Doggo Life channel. I'm Victoria and today I'll be sharing with you how I make golden paste at home for our dogs. If you like doggo lifestyle videos, be sure to click the like button right now, subscribe to this channel and turn on the notification bell so you never miss a single video we post here. On this channel, we do unboxing videos, product reviews, and all kinds of dog hacks to make your life as a dog parent more enjoyable. I'd like for you to stick around to this entire video because I'll be sharing with you how to make this super affordable, amazing, healthy supplement for your dog and how easy it is. Also, I'll be sharing with you how to reach the perfect consistency for this golden paste because many of you have told us that that's what you're having a problem with. Golden paste is such an affordable and easy supplement to make for your dog. And not only can you use it for your dog, but you can also incorporate it into your own diet. It has amazing benefits and it's so worth it. We learned about golden paste. It's made of turmeric during the time when our Kimari was diagnosed with cancer in early 2018 and our holistic veterinarian had us make this golden paste as part of Kimari's natural cancer protocol and we've been using it for the entire squad ever since. Don't worry, Kimari has recovered beautifully in just 28 days. Her cancer is gone and she's doing wonderful and she's absolutely thriving. After I show you how to make this golden paste recipe, I'll also share with you what we use during camping and travel because golden paste and this concept is in our pup's diet every single day. I also want to let you know that to get the exact measurements, details, storage, the correct dose for your pup and all that good stuff, I didn't want to make too long of a video. So I leave here in the description of the video, this document that you can download with all the details for this golden paste recipe. And of course it's on huskysquat.com. Okay. So here is what golden paste is made of. It's wonderful because the ingredients are so accessible. But this is the final product. This is what it looks like when I finished it. This is what it's made of. Primarily, everyone pronounces it slightly differently, but I call it turmeric. It's also called curcumin. That's another way of calling this particular spice. It's a root. And this is why I only get organic because whenever you grow anything and it's not organic, then all the chemicals seep into the root. So make sure you use organic turmeric. Okay. This is the primary ingredient. The next thing is filtered water. You only want to use purified good water. And if you want more information about the water that we use, be sure to watch the other video here on Doggo Life where we talk about the filter that we use and how wonderful it is. So that's the second ingredient. This is whole black pepper and I believe it's called piperin. I don't know if I'm pronouncing it correctly, but in this recipe, that's what it is called. This activates the turmeric and makes it a lot more absorbable and a lot more effective, but you only want to use whole pepper and grind it fresh. So keep that in mind. Don't get the pre-ground pepper. You want black pepper, but the entire whole kernels. Okay. I bought a really large bottle of cold pressed organic coconut oil, and I don't like keeping a large jar in the kitchen. So I just put it in smaller jars, but this is what this is using it for so many different purposes and obviously for golden paste. And lastly, this is organic ginger, just like the turmeric root. Ginger is also a root. This is why I only use organic. I only use a little bit and you can introduce this later after your pup has already had this formula for a little while and everything is going well, which it should, but I like being gentle. I add the ginger later in only very small amounts. Also, if your pup is very sensitive, you can begin the uh, black pepper amount that I have in the recipe at a quarter of the amount and then increase slowly with time. The wonderful thing is that you likely have all these ingredients already at home. And what I do actually, I buy these in bulk on Amazon 
because they could get expensive when you get them in smaller bottles. So I'll leave a link here in the description of this video, how I get especially the turmeric, the ginger, both organic and the black pepper, the whole black pepper on Amazon for bulk price. It is wonderful. The recipe that I have on huskysquad.com, which we'll be making today, yields 16 ounces. This is what this jar is. It's just a wide mouth, but this is 16 ounces and they would usually look like this. This is how I store them. I only use glass because plastic is a no. So this is usually the size that I would be using, but I really like the wide mouth jar. It's so wonderful for being able to scoop the golden paste out. Or you can also use two eight ounce jars and this way you have them you know a smaller one in the fridge and one you use and you can just kind of cycle back and forth but this is the same amount as the 16 ounce jar but those are my favorite options okay so let's make the golden paste i gather all my ingredients first this one makes it very easy Using a small pot, I first add the turmeric powder after measuring it. And then after that, I add the purified water. And then turn on the heat on a very low flame and I keep mixing it and mixing it till everything is nicely combined. There's no more bubbles or powder floating around and I keep mixing it gently. This is where a lot of people go wrong here because people expect the turmeric to become paste-like very quickly, but this is a patient process. It takes around seven to 10 minutes of mixing the turmeric. Make sure that you actually mix it, the turmeric and the water. Otherwise it will get clunky and it will just, it will not work out well. So as you are mixing it, take little breaks. And that's when I usually like to prepare my black pepper I grind my black pepper and then I can measure it. I do the same for measuring my coconut oil and I set it aside, but I keep mixing and mixing the turmeric with the water on a low flame. That's very important, don't cook it high, but on a low flame until it becomes a really nice consistency. You don't want it where it starts drying out, but you want a nice creamy thick texture. Once it becomes a very nice thick creamy texture, that's when you turn off the flame. If you're still having problems after the seven, eight minute point, and you feel like the turmeric is not nice and thick and creamy consistency, and it's still too runny, you can add a little bit more turmeric and vice versa, adding a little bit more water if it's become too thick. But most of the time, when you do this gently and you're washing it and you're mixing it, this should be the correct measurement amount. Okay. After that, once I turn off the low flame, just turn it off completely. I add all the remainder of the ingredients, mix it really, really well till everything is combined. Even the coconut oil, you want it to be a nice paste and a nice texture. Just keep going and going till it's all dissolved and all mixed in well. And then simply pour it all into your favorite glass storing jar. And that's it. And this should store beautifully in the fridge. For all the details and the dosing, be sure you go to huskysquad.com, download this file that we created for you, it has everything there, and you'll have great benefit from using it.
Okay, so here are the gold nuggets and information why you should be incorporating this amazing healthy supplement into your dog's life and even your own. Number one, golden paste is amazing in dealing with arthritis. It doesn't matter if it's for you or for your dog. It really alleviates symptoms and it helps beautifully with managing this long term. Number two, turmeric and ginger are both incredible antioxidants. They're amazing to fight inflammation, which is so important for all of us. And they also have amazing cancer fighting properties. Whole black pepper, also called piperin, is amazing to increase the absorption of the turmeric. Without this, you are not going to have the amazing benefits that you could get from turmeric. So it's so important to use this recipe so you can really activate the amazing health benefits of the turmeric. Turmeric is fat soluble, which means that when you eat it with a healthy fat, it increases the digestion and the bioavailability of the turmeric. So this is why we add the organic coconut oil to this golden paste recipe so you benefit from the turmeric even more. A number of studies have shown that cooking turmeric gently, not at a super high heat and not for prolonged periods, but cooking it gently breaks down the turmeric incredibly well and it increases the digestibility and also absorption. In other words, just using turmeric powder on your dog's food is not going to do a whole lot than combining all of these methods in one and this is why the golden paste is extremely powerful. Okay, I have three tips for you on this subject. Number one, if your pup is generally sensitive or is currently on medication, be sure to check with your holistic veterinarian if you can find one or you can chat with your current vet to see if the turmeric is not going to interfere with the current medication because some do. So make sure you check that. Number two, only store the golden paste in glass jars. We know plastic is a no-no and I absolutely love mason jars. Those are my favorite. They're actually quite affordable to find and buy. You can get them at Target, even on Amazon. I often get them for under a dollar a piece and I use them for everything. Mason jars are wonderful and these sizes are perfect. Number three, like I always say, introduce things gently anything that you do with your dog. And the same goes for golden paste. In the description of this video, you can find a link that you can download and get the measurements, get our recommended doses and all that good stuff. This way you start easy and gently build up. It's so much better for your dog. So the only thing I change slightly is when we're camping or travel because I like giving this to our pups every single day. Actually, our holistic veterinarian who recommended that we begin doing this is the one that told us that we need to keep this in Kimari's diet forever, right? So it's very important. For camping, for traveling, this is not as convenient because I like keeping this in the fridge. It's the best place to store it and all that other good stuff. So this is great for home, which we use most of the time, right? For camping and travel, there are two different options that I like. I don't use them all the time at home. I only use this for travel because A, this one, although very good, it has everything that this needs very similar recipe. It does have other ingredients that I don't like to give our pups every single day, but this one actually works out just fine. The other reason too, this is so much more affordable with four pups, plus it's so everything is organic. I control all the ingredients. I absolutely love it. But then again, camping and travel, we need something. This is a great option and I've been using this for years and a holistic vet is okay with us using this on occasion, right? So this is a good option. My last option that I recently found that I really, really like is this organic tincture of turmeric. It also has all the good stuff that we need, but it's a lot more pricey than both of those options. But this is wonderful. It's pure, it's clean. The ingredients are very simple. All it has is organic. The other ingredients besides what's in here is organic vegetable glycerin, triple distilled water, and some trace minerals. However, the only thing this one doesn't have is a healthy fat 
which would be really helpful and again this is why this is the best option. Also though, this is so great for camping and travel, it's a small bottle, so it's a great option to use when we're on the road. But now you can tell why this one always wins for everyday use. I'll also leave links to both of these products in the description of this video. You can find everything we talk about on Doggo Life on HuskySquad.com, so be sure you go check it out over there too. If you enjoyed this video, I know you will love our main channel Husky Squad where you'll be inspired to live your most amazing life with your dog. We show you our amazing camping experiences, hiking, cabin hopping, and everything we do with the Husky Squad. I'll leave here a link in the description of this video or you can just search on YouTube here Husky Squad and you'll find us there. Also, in the description of this video, you will find a link to our entire list of supplements we give to the squad and why. We also have a detailed video here on Doggo Life where we discuss all the supplements we give to the squad, so be sure you go check it out there. Lastly, be sure you subscribe to this channel, Doggo Life, turn the notification bell so you never miss a single video we post here. I hope you enjoyed this video. It was so nice having you today. Thanks so much, and we'll see you next time on Doggo Life.